Hi, my name Magnets. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use ChatGPT to search the internet without having to scroll through endless search results. So if you are looking for a faster way to search the internet, this video is for you. Let's get started. So as you can see here, I'm going to talk about who won the World Cup in 2022. As you can see, Argentina is the national football team that has won the World Cup. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to go to ChatGPT and ask it the same question. So who won the World Cup in 2022? As you can see, it gave wrong information who was won by Germany. So that is false. Anyone who watched the World Cup knows that it was not Germany who won the FIFA World Cup. And this can be very dangerous if you're using ChatGPT for work. So in order to prevent this, I have a plugin that allows ChatGPT to search the web. Now let me turn this on and ask it the same question. Who won the World Cup in 2022? And what it does is that it's going to search the internet and provide you the information of who he think really won the World Cup with the sources as well. These sources is really great so that you can always have a reference where do they get that information from. So if the sources come from a reputable website, that means that it's working really well. So what you have searched here, I've gave it three results. So you probably search one, two, and three. And what it does is that it search the best information to give you here. So this one will be really great for you if you are searching for data for your startup pitch deck, a presentation, or anything else that you require data to help improve your arguments. Such example would be something like this. So I type it in like this, give me growth data of green technology for investment post 2023. So what it's going to do is that it's going to search the internet to give me information or data that I can use. There you go. This is the information that he has given me. Although it does not have 2023, it has provided me data for 2022, which is good enough. So according to green energy number three, which is technically here, which is the source here, green energy stocks provided investors with a huge long-term growth opportunity and 2022 inflation reduction act allocated 369 billion to invest in climate change solution and technology. Number two states that the global green technology and sustainability, so that's where you are getting the sources here. That will actually speed up your research and speed up your ability to craft persuasive presentations, your pitch deck, or whatever you require that requires you to search the internet endlessly. So the great thing here is actually the sources that it provides you. So you can always double check the sources to see whether or not this is reputable. As you can see, this is by Forbes right here. Let me just go into here. So since it's by Forbes, it stands to be somewhat authoritative. That gives you a very, very powerful argument when you are building your presentation. So in order for you to get this wonderful ChatGPT plugin, what you need to do is go into Google, search for Google Chrome extension. You'll be here called Chrome Web Store. Click onto this, you come into something like this. From here, what you need to do is search the store for Web Chat GPT. So with this, all you can do is technically you can add it to your Chrome. Once you've added it to your Chrome, you should be able to use the features and what I've shown you just now. So yeah, this is how you can use ChatGPT to search the internet. I list a couple of links down in the description below to help you to be a master ChatGPT user as well. So do check the description out. And if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe because I'll be sharing with you more videos like this out there. Also, don't forget to check out some videos that I'm posting here that will help you master ChatGPT so much more faster. So that's all. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.